Hi, I'm Bert Soren, president of Soren X Exercise Equipment. Soren X is an American made, family owned business here in Columbia, South Carolina. We build custom equipment, strength equipment, human performance equipment for colleges, pro teams, uh, high schools, and anyone who wants the, the best gear for their strength endeavors. So, what's the, what gun is this? I, I love all the different this is, fire art you have. And yeah, this is one of our newer ones. This is our Summit. Okay. It's a straight pole toggle bolt action. Okay. Operates super So is that simple. for speed or is that it's for... It's for speed. You can operate it one-handed. You know, the cool thing is you can shoot it suppressed. Oh, yeah. And you really don't hear anything other oh, than yeah, because you don't have to worry dropping. about the cycle. Sure. Yeah. Oh, that's a great here. That's awesome. So we just load the sucker up. So just slam it home. Slam it home. We should be good to go. Cool. Right on. All right. 100 yards, this thing. Dead center. This thing is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> it's so accurate. You could literally just watch. You could literally just watch the rounds sink in. Yeah, that that's what's so much fun about that straight pull yeah. toggle bolt action. Is there's no moving parts really, so it's you know, the gun just stays flat. Right, shooting. right. No, it's just like, it just, you literally will watch the bullet fly because of, of the recoil is just eaten up right there. Yeah. And then just cycle it. That's amazing. What a gun. We go back. Who got you into shooting? Yeah, okay. So my dad got me into shooting when, oh gosh, since I could remember. I remember being a little kid and having a 22, a little single action hammer pull 22. And that's where I learned gun safety and learned how to, how to shoot and how to aim and how to, you know, trigger pull. Was it a lot of just time on the range, or did you guys hunt a lot as kid when you were? Both, okay. a lot of time on the range, um, but we I was in the woods since I was a little boy. Uh, I didn't really get super active in it until a little bit later on, or, or should I say successful until okay. later on. <laughs> um, but spent a lot of time with, with weapons, and, and so there's that love in there for a fine piece of machinery. You know, I know you're obviously busy. Right. Why is it so important for you to find time to get to the range, or you know, I know you're a big hunter as well. To take that time. Yeah, well, that's a great question. There's two reasons. First is my meditation time, kind of my time to get in the flow state and enjoy something uh, that I grew up loving and I fantasized about being able to do more so when I was older and now I get to do it. Unfortunately, the time isn't there, but I have to prioritize that time for me time because that's, uh, it's just it's how I relax and how I get to, to, to work through the mechanics of something that I could remove variables and, and train for something again like I did in athletics. So the shooting and hunting is, is, is totally something that's just good for my soul. I knew what I wanted to do when I was a kid. This is yeah. just allowing me to, just, to still do it. <laughs> Sit around and shoot a 22 with friends, that's what I wanted to do when I was a kid. I'm 43 years old and I still get to do it. <laughs> a lot of people would say I'm still just a kid. <laughs> still just a kid, and, and I think it's a, you're a success at life if you get to do what you've always wanted to do. Yeah, that, very well said. Well, why don't we take a couple more final few shots here before you we- you never ask. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting itchy with this thing sitting around not getting, not getting to eat. <laughs> oh gosh, this would be great. All right, so that hog looks like it might need one in the ear. 